Beth here. Welcome to my channel. And today I'm so happy because I had the day off of work and I've literally been waiting for this package. I think it shipped out on like December 12th or something like that. And I've been waiting for it to arrive. And finally it arrived today and I have the day off of work. I'm currently sipping my tea out of my Joy mug um, and I got some wax. So I'm filming two wax hauls today and this is the first one from my very first ever order from Rose Girls and I'm so excited. I got I think nine bags, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and plus a sample from um, her, I think her name is Jenny. Let me check. Jenny Oaks, and this is her card, in case if you want to know her card. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited to get into it. I have two nighttime blends in here that I'm really, really looking forward to giving a try. But of course, I'm going to wait until like a month since they've shipped out. That way then they will have enough cure time and everything like that. So the first one that I have is, oh, I guess they shipped out on December 14th. This first one is in Tea and Cakes. And let me smell it real fast. Um, I've only ever melted one other Tea and Cakes from that Smell Good shop. Um, called afternoon tea and they both smell really really similar so I think they're gonna be pretty much really really similar and it all will come down to like scent throw um, like strength and longevity depending on which one will I like more um, then I also got apple fritter um, which I wrote the dates on these of the day that they shipped because I want to be able to keep track of how long have I had my wax for. Um, that's something that I never did with my candles or my body care, like using it up in order or anything like that. And it's just something I want to do differently when it comes to my wax melt collection um, or stash, not a collection, a stash. <laughs> Um, this next one is a waffle cone, and I'm going to smell this one. I haven't smelt any of these yet, so. Mm, this one smells good. It smells sweet and yummy. <laughs> um, I got mostly bakery from her. Um, other than the two nighttime scents, I think it's all bakery. This one is her Cupcakes at Tiffany's, and it doesn't have the notes on it, but I think hers has toffee in it. The one from that Smell Good shop that I like, it doesn't have the toffee in it. Mm, you definitely get that toffee note. Mm, I don't know if I'm gonna like it or not. Um, but anyways, you can't judge it till you melt it, right? Um, what's next? What's next? What's next? Oh, yay. I'm excited for this one. This one is Absolute Coffee. And I won't melt this one in my bedroom because my sister does not like coffee scents until after she goes away to college. Oh, this one smells good. It smells just like a coffee shop. And I definitely will melt this one. Um, and hopefully we'll enjoy it. This next one is Serendipity. And you guys, I cannot find this one anywhere on the website anymore to even find the scent notes. I'm pretty sure I remember it saying something about cherry uh, when I ordered it. But I can't quite remember. So if you know what the notes on Rose Girl Serendipity are, let me know in the key, in the um, comments down below because I would like to know what they are. And then I have Jelly Donut, which is this pretty purple wax. But we haven't gotten to my favorite wax color yet. Haven't gotten to it yet. 
This one smells so good, just like fruity and bakery. I'm gonna move these over just a bit. Over just a bit. Okay. These two I was able to find the scent notes on. So this first one is Goodnight Moon. And these ones are my favorite. Let me tell you guys. I mean, I cannot talk today. Let me take one out and show you guys. So it's white chunks, but at the bottom they have a little bit of pink. And some of them I think have a little bit of purple. <laughs> um, that one has a little bit of purple, as you can see right there. Mm, and it smells amazing. I'm so excited to use this one. I don't even think I can wait. The key notes, I have them written down just on a post-it note on the back, are sweet lavender, pink sugar, peppermint, and birthday cake. And then I also have this one, which I do like these wax melts as well. Um, these colors, they're not like multicolors in the same one like how the white with pink at the bottom and white with purple at the bottom but these ones are green purple and blue and they look so cute and these these are in the scent you need to calm down which is sweet lavender cotton candy frosting and vanilla lace and this one smells really really good as well if you have been watching my wax hauls for a while, then you know that I'm actually on the hunt for a good nighttime bedroom scent that I'm on the hunt for. And then my sample that I got, which, oh my goodness, I did not know she will give such generous sample sizes. This one is in Spruce Willis, and it has little glitter on the top. And this one, is mm, very masculine cologne tree type of scent. I don't know if I'm gonna like this one. <laughs> um, I don't really like manly cologne scents that much. Anyways, I probably might gift this one away or give it a try and see what I think. Um, but yeah, that is everything for my very first ever Rose Girls haul. And I am so excited, you guys. I'm going to put these in my drawer. And then when it comes to my melting basket starting on January 15th, I think I'm going to be pulling like three to five of these out to try. So I'm so excited and I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I'll see you next time. And as always, make sure you stay positive till then. Bye.